Hey there, guys, and welcome to another episode of Legend of the Banjo Kazooie The Jiggies of Time. We are still in Gerudo Fortress, well, the level of Gerudo Fortress, and I did look up what to do um, in between episodes, and as it turns out, there is something that I overlooked when, when we first entered this level a couple episodes ago. So what we're going to do now, based upon that hint right there, since I remembered Rentilda said something about the tent showing a hint. We are going to go down here in the water that looks like it is very toxic, but actually it does not affect Banjo's health at all, surprisingly. And we are going to go all the way to this rack. This rack right here. And based upon that image, we need to ground pound. Whoa, would you look at that? Oh my goodness, it's on a timer. I'm just going to wait for it to uh, run out, and then I'll try again. All right, here... I was so close! Well, you know what? I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try the whole pause and unpause thing. Oh, that kind of cut me off. I'm gonna try again as soon as the timer runs out. Alright, let's try this again. Hopefully it actually works this time. No! No! Almost no! I was so close! No! Ooh! Okay, almost there! Almost there! And... Yes! Yes! Oh, there's a mumbo token underneath the bridge. Okay, I'm gonna do a safe state and try to get that token and do my very best not to uh, land when I don't want to. Okay, there we go. Oh, there's some gold feathers in there, but I don't want to collect those because... Oh my goodness, a Jinjo! Okay, well... I really don't want to have to... Unless, are there, fl are there other fly pads? There better be other fly pads. So I can just uh, fly again. Okay, good, there is another fly pad around here. So at least I know that all is not lost. I think there could be another, like, is there, like, another, okay, and there is Hybrid Towers. Of course, we can't fly to it. Yeah, Hybrid Towers was the, uh, the hub world from Ukulele. Nice little Easter egg. All right, and I was supposed to break that rock. Let's try this again. Uh, are you sure I can't get it like this? It looks like you're supposed to break this. Yep, I knew it. I knew it. There was a single Jiggy in there. Alright, Geronimo! Sure hope that there are some more eggs that I can find. Given as to how many I used. In the, in the last episode, just trying to break that rock. I don't see any eggs in the water. Okay. Just gonna fly around, see if I can find... Okay, well, here are some musical notes. Gonna need to land here to get them all.
Okay, got them. Now do jump back to this fly pad. Okay, good. You know what would really be bad? If Banjo, by some bad luck, landed right on top of the platform where the fly pad is, and then just instantly died. That would be terrible! Come on, get the Jinjo. Okay, and don't land. I am serious, don't land. Come on, fly out, don't land. Th there is this uh, area before. No, I don't think I can go in there until I have the transformation. Okay, I, I have two eggs right now, which... I don't think that that is going to be enough. Okay. Is there... Okay, well, I better grab this gold feather before I head back. Can I get back over here, or is it just too far now? Okay, it was too far. Sadly. I, I do wonder. What's gonna happen if I... Okay, I guess nothing happened. Alright, I'm back. I'm back here now. And since I used up a lot of feathers, I'm gonna be... I'm gonna need to be collecting them... Collecting them now. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and look up what I need to do next. So, BRB. Well, the next thing that the, uh, the guy told me would be to break the rocks. Which I think will lead to more rocks. And I did try breaking it earlier. So, I'm gonna see if I can uh, go ahead and try to use the save states. And then try to break the rock. Hopefully I can do it. Yes! Hallelujah! Hallelujah! I can go behind the rocks now. Or underneath these rocks. Oh, missed it! Come on, get it. Come on, get it. Alright, better be able to surface real soon. So we're in a hidden cavern. You know, this kind of feels more like it's Gruntilda's lair than it is a uh, Gerudo Valley. Like, like an area of Gruntilda's lair that n was never found. Hello. Goodbye. Four jiggies. Isn't there an area that has... Oh, there's a tiny hole here. Although, come to think of it, are you supposed to be able to come down here 
with the transformation. And I could have sworn I saw in that guide video that there were supposed to be eggs around here, but I don't see any of them right now. Unless I was looking at a different part of the video, I gotta go check real quickly. Well, what I saw was actually just... Just collecting some eggs from earlier, so I'll meet you guys back outside of... Well, I'll meet you guys back at the next spot that we will go to, so... BRB, again. Five minutes later. Hey there, guys. Now we are back at Gerudo Fortress. And one thing... Something I can't believe that I didn't do when we were here last time is... Well, there is a spot that I totally overlooked, and it's right here. Yeah, you see? Notes that have not been collected. Now, I have no idea where this is going to lead to. Ah, it leads to right here. A spot that I was not able to get to before. Oh, there's an opening over there. Oh, wait, no, it's just a rock. I thought it was an opening, but it's a rock. Oh, well, now it is an opening. I can just keep breaking through rocks. Does this spot lead anywhere? Oh, it, it just leads to a gated up area. And I heard a Jinjo! Jinky! And I still hear the Jinjo. Oh, I think I need to jump my way over to here. I can see him, but I can't get to him. Was I, like, supposed to uh, jump? Okay, let, let me take a look here. Super Smash Bros. Oh, 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 I see. Uh, we can't get to him right now because we need the transformation for that. Okay, well, at least I now know that I need the transformation. And I, I ignored these feathers before because I did not need them before. But now I do need them, and now I have collected them. And now we are going to go back to the spirit temple. So I am going to need to look up again as to what else we need to do that I totally did not think to do last time. Five minutes later. Alright, so after watching the guide video for a bit, also I think I've overlooked uh, a, a gold feather over here. You know? Or, or, or did I? I don't see... Okay, maybe I did get it. I had the feeling there was something about that shadow. Yeah, there's this this magic carpet that I did not know about before. Or it did not wait long enough for it to come down. So we're going to wait for it to come down. Okay, here we go. I wonder what, where it's going to take me. Okay. This is going pretty well. Just made a safe state, just in case. And now we are climbing on the statue's arms. One of which is broken. Okay, and I've noticed that switch over there, that grunty switch. I wonder if there's any way to get over there. Over onto that switch. Okay, well anyway, I'm just gonna go ahead and enter the mouth of the statue. Which does not lead into a stomach, it just leads to Mumbo. Kind of referring to the question of the day last time. Well, the last common question of the day that I had. 
You know, if, if the if the transformation, if Mumbo transformed Banjo into a washing machine, shouldn't the the, the fanfare be wah wah wah? I think that that would make better sense. Really, a room? You knew new increase is a household object even for you this well room can fly Ooh, that's actually quite useful can bad birds meet entrance before they go yum and in case you haven't figured it out by now it's a retexture of the b transformation although it is a bit harder to know where the eggs are you know, this is kind of funny. Room Banjo. Come on! Come on. How am I not able to get the eggs? They're like right there. It feels like... It feels like it should be grabbing them and yet I'm not. Ugh, okay, well... You know what? I'm just gonna transform back for a moment, and then grab the eggs. Because clearly there is something wrong here. Got the eggs, now back into a broom. You know, it kind of looked like a fly was flying out of the statue's mouth. Oh, and there is a... Jiggy. Jiggy. Oh, gonna land to grab the Jinjo. You know, there are some areas over... Oh, wait, I can't get to them. Well, at least I can't get to some of them. Okay, well, here are some eggs. Am I gonna be able to grab these ones? Okay, well, I can grab these ones. I wonder why I couldn't grab the other ones before. And there is a witch switch right there, but we can't pound on it right now because we're broom. You know, it is kind of funny seeing Banjo walk around as a broom. Oh, I figured that there would be some... Uh, oh. Momu token in the back. Okay. I grab that. Now I grab these notes. I'm thinking of ending off the episode real soon. Okay, I was not sure as to why the uh, the up button was not working. Okay, well, I think that I'm going to call this a good place to end off the episode. So... Gonna once again ask this comment question of the day. I don't know how many people will have answered this answered by now, but the comment question of the day, which I've asked a couple episodes ago, which I will get to eventually when we get to Grunty's Castle, is Is there anything that you think is scarier than the Wicked Witch of the West from the Wizard of Oz? This is uh, in concerns to the Wicked Witch of the West episode of Sesame Street that was initially banned. Uh, leave your response in the uh, comments below, and I will give you my response when we get to Grunty's Castle.